What's up? What's up? Hab good habit that I've been trying to build called making YouTube videos. Um, yeah, busting one out because I'm stuck in traffic right now. I was uh, earlier there was a uh, there was like a I was sitting but in one spot for like 40 minutes because of an accident. Now, Google Maps says there's an accident, this spot's gonna be for like an hour and a half, all up in the mountains and stuff. Oh, all right, so, um, there's a, there's a couple new things since last week's video. I, uh, today there's something new, and, 29. May 29, 2023, I fell out another breakthrough. And that big, that breakthrough is called the pop-off breakthrough, is what I call it. Um, so, so because I started taking cold showers in the morning as one of my new habits, and it has been, I guess, training my mind to get used to being uncomfortable. So I kind of, I know that that goes for like everything. Like you're supposed to be uncomfortable. You're supposed to be comfortable with being uncomfortable. And it, I'm taking that into my workouts now. So, so that I'm comfortable with when it starts to hurt, when it starts to feel painful. And that's when I start to pop off and just make it hurt even more. Um, I think that's pretty cool. Today, today is one of those days where I had to wake up at two in the morning and I was feeling really, really tired. Um, I think I got about five hours of sleep. It's like how it, it's how it always is. Get five hours of sleep, wake up really early, and I'm tired. I don't like going to sleep at 6 p.m. It's just, I don't know. It feels like my day's not finished. I don't like it, but yeah, I got I got some energy drinks. I drank one of them, had a headache, but I was awake at least. Um, it made me decide to put some exercise into every single day um, in a different way because I kind of I kind of depend on my exercise to be either at my fitness class or or playing dance games on my machine that's at my sister's house right now. Um, so, because I felt like I had, like, a requirement in order to exercise. I didn't, I didn't like that. I don't like that. So, on my Finch app, the one I've been putting all my goals on, I, I added, um, at first I did 50 push-ups and 50 sit-ups. Then I did then I did the 50 push-ups kind of quickly, I guess. I felt like I needed more. Um I the first I have like some little skinny baby arms right now, by the way. Maybe one day in the future I'll see some big nice juicy arms, meaty arms, but right now the little little baby arms but um yeah so i i did like 25 push-ups then i waited like 20 seconds i did 15 i think yeah 25 then 15 and then and then 10 because um yeah after the first set it was a bit harder to get to 25 again um so that was 50 right there and after I did that, I was just like, it's not enough, not enough, I need more. 
So I just added 50 more. I made it 100 push-ups a day. And I knocked that out too. A little while later, it wasn't the same time. And then after that, I felt like I needed some more exercise, so I busted out 30 more push-ups later, um, which felt good. But my arms did feel a little weaker. So probably with more doing more push-ups with the days to come um, if I'm like super sore I might just make it less again we'll see how it goes it's trial and error and I also with the sit-ups I I heard that they're it's bad for your back in the long run so I looked up other things to work on my abs because I got a, I got a pretty big belly right now a truck driver belly not that bad but it's there it's something that needs to be worked on so so I want to be working on my abs that way they're nice and fit for so by the time I start eating healthy and stuff because it's gonna come eventually if I uh, I'm pretty sure I'm just one day I'm just gonna be like fuck this shit I mean healthy now starting now so when that happens um, and my, and my gut goes down, I want those abs to show I've been working on them. It, uh, I have been eating a little bit healthier than in the past. I'm eating Greek yogurt now, blended, pre-blended Greek yogurt, but it shows it as one serving. So I'm not just like chugging that, chugging it because it tastes so dang good. Um, and I'm trying to... Like when I'm at work, I'll bring two sandwiches. The the bread isn't good bread. The lettuce doesn't do anything. So I know I know I can substitute a different bread, and also substitute spinach for the lettuce. So that's something I could probably do in the future. But right now, the way it is, I'll eat a sandwich. Then for a snack, I'll eat a yogurt, and then later again, I'll eat a sandwich again, and then a yogurt again. And um, that that way I keep the protein going for my muscles and stuff. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm not doing it good or well, but but as I learn and as I start wanting to do better, I know um, I know my diet will start to catch up with with the things I want. So. So that's how it is with that. Um, there's the diet, there's the exercise, and then there is this bad boy right here. Ba boom ba boom. Power discipline. I already mentioned that I first started reading in my last video. And right now you can see my bug marks in there. So I've been doing some reading. I'm currently on page 87. As as we talk about this, the chapter I'm at is meditation for self-discipline and focus. Um, this book is really really good. Um, the last book, the Dare to Lead book, I just felt like I didn't need it, so I was just so un interested in it. And this one, the Power of Discipline. It, basically tells me like this is exactly what you need right now and this is what you need to read so I feel like I'm just like popping off on it like I'm hella reading it um so I don't remember the last day I made a video for my YouTube might have been Wednesday like today so seven days ago but I've gotten 82 pages um this book only has 128 pages, so I'll be, I'm pretty sure I'll be finished with it by the time I make another video. Um, I, uh, I'm reading Atomic Habits with, with my girlfriend right now. Um, I think I'm, I'm like the only one that reads it though. So maybe I'll just adopt it and take it over when I'm done with this one 
but she might feel left behind if I do that. So instead of that idea, I'll, I'll probably start looking into another book that I can read. Probably The Power of Now. Um, maybe that book will tell me get rid of your bad, or it'll, it'll help motivate me to get rid of the bad habits that I'm currently dealing with right now. Um, the ones that it's a little bit more hard to just kind of shove off a cliff, but, um, if I read The Power of Now, maybe that'll, that'll get me to, give me that little push to just do it. Because this Power of Discipline book, it's just helped me understand a lot of stuff with when it comes to discipline, and it's throwing in a couple other things in there. It, it talks about the book Atomic Habits in it, too, because habits is basically what discipline is. Yeah, so I'm really enjoying this book. I'm going to finish it up soon. Right now it's talking about Shaolin monks and Buddhism and how they how disciplined they are um and and like yeah the meditation and stuff good for the good for the mind um i was i was also thinking about throwing in a, another morning habit which is running running like probably two miles no regardless what time i wake up run two miles just to start and um and then take a cold shower and start my day like that. See, see how it goes. Um, that's just an idea, though. Hasn't been implemented, and the thought hasn't really gone through to go through with that yet. But this is where I am right now. My current point, my growth. Um, yeah, so guess this is a 12 minute video today still stuck in the same spot not tight <laughs> but yeah growth baby let's uh, summarize everything put push ups 100 push ups minimum a day the sit-ups, I changed them to bicycle kicks because those hurt my abs, so I'm going to be doing bicycle kicks. And the way that I set that is 45 seconds each time for three sets is the goal each day. And, um, yeah, so, yeah, sit-ups, bicycle kicks, reading still going on. All this stuff is becoming natural, and, and I I bring I bring my Nintendo Switch just in case like I'm waiting too long somewhere and I'm sick of reading or whatever else I'm doing. I'll just play some games for a little bit. But even though it's there. I don't, I don't even touch it before I'm doing everything else, like, I don't know, I feel really good when I'm reading and learning stuff, I feel really good when I'm exercising, the push-ups and the bicycle kicks made me feel really good today, this is the first day I ever did that, so, I feel like I'm gonna be doing that more often, well, every single day, but, yeah, I'm happy I, I put this stuff in. So, yeah, I said it was going to be a 12 minute video, I meant 14, unless I want to go longer, do I? It's not like anyone's going to watch it anyway, I could just talk to myself forever, baby. Um, the, less, the videos that I've made previous to this, I don't like how it sounds without having a mic. Um, this one we're not moving, so I'm guessing it'll be okay. So, uh, yeah, there's a let's look, at, look at this view, it's kind of nice over here. 
not moving of course accidents bye shoot bye love you bye